Welcome to the video lecture on time invariance of a system. In this video, we'll consider a continuous time system y of t is equal to e to the power x of t. To begin with, we already know the definition of time invariance as a shift in the input must lead to an identical shift in the output. So first we'll try to understand the nature of the system. So x of t is the input. It is fed to a system of operator h and gets you the output y of t which is equal to h of x of t. The nature of the system is whatever you feed in the input x of t, it takes the exponential of that input and gets you the output. So that is the nature of the system. So to test for time invariance, first I'll consider a shift in the input x of t minus t naught. So this is fed to a system of operator h to get an output y of t. So now previously we had fed x of t, we got the output as exponential of x of t. Now we are feeding the input as x of t minus t naught, therefore I have to get exponential of x of t minus t naught as the output. So this is what I get in the first half. In the second half, I'll consider a shift in the output. To get that, we already have the expression for y of t. In that, replace every t with t minus t naught. So e to the power x of, so here I find t, so replace that with t minus t naught. So this is what I get in the second half. So by comparing these two as they are equal, we can say that the given system is time invariant. So hence we have concluded that the system y of t is equal to e to the power x of t is time invariant in nature.